I'm Chuck, a sensible border collie from Missouri. This is my poodle pal, Tilly. <laughs> what a dilly. Climb into my Jeep and we'll take you on a multi-state road trip with yummy treats where you'll meet dog heroes from the Civil War. Like Big Brutus, a Newfoundland who earned his stripes at Antietam National Battlefield. He tipped the scales at 130 pounds plus. Pause to consider that. Legend has it that Brutus learned how to salute and would chase anything, even flying bullets called mini balls. Now there's a fetching idea. Fido wouldn't be up to those tricks. We heard about that pooch when Tilly popped for a stop in Springfield, Illinois, where we visited the Abraham Lincoln Presidential Library and Museum. Lincoln loved Fido, a mutt he had to leave behind when he was elected president. But he found Fido a good home back in Springfield. Speaking of home, we were glad to get back. Our suitcases full of moon pies, our minds full of memories, and our hearts touched by the dog tales we heard along the way. We learned a lot about the Civil War, but most importantly, we discovered that dogs have been and always will be man's best friend. And that's no chihuahua. <laughs>